Hello and welcome to High Caliber TV, your source for figure model updates every Wednesday and Friday. So today on the workbench, I'm just going to be doing a quick update on this fella, the Scale 75 Confederate officer who was reading the casualty toll. And he's going to be do done as a commission thing. I'm going to be putting up, him up for sale on eBay. But I just wanted to show where he's at. And so today I finished the, the coat, basically, his officer's jacket. And as you can see... The highlights were done in a downward fashion, as always, using a zenithal lighting technique. So from here, the light spreads down onto him. But the really fun part that I did today was the shadows. And I initially started with a less intense but still very dark shadow color. And I'll put the mixes in the description below of what I used. But basically I sprayed it upwards into where the shadows would be and you sort of had to use a bit of artistic license and use a bit of, well, I mean, airbrush control, you need that no matter what you're doing. So yeah, that's the shadows are where the delicate work starts to come into play a little bit. But then once the initial shadowing was done, as you can see, there was a far more intense shadow applied, which was more black and I've counseled against using black before, but I tempered the black with uh, an olive drab plus a medium gray plus the prime base blue that I used for, the, for his coat. And bear in mind, in all colors, in all mixes, except for the final, final highlight, gray was added as I wanted him to be very clearly a Confederate and not a Union officer, even though they both wore blue in actuality. It's just that the rebels used far more gray. And later in the war, as production started to shut down, they obviously switched to a very, very much gray cloak. So there he is. I'm really pleased with the way he's coming along. I love these figures. Unfortunately, we don't stock them, but you know, who knows what the future will hold, basically. So thanks very much for watching, and I will see you next time. Follow us on Facebook, Pinterest, and Twitter for more photos like this, daily stock updates, etc. I'll put the link to our homepage in the description. Thanks very much for watching, and I will see you next time.